Hey guys, it is me, Life Simmer, and today, bleh, let's redo that, shall we? Hey guys, it is me, Life Simmer, and welcome back to The Sims 3 Island Paradise LP Part 25. Okay, so in this part, we need to fight a shark, whether it's the death of me or Kylie. See what I did there? <laughs> Um, so before I get into the game light, I want to let you all know that the movie stuff trailer is officially up on my channel. So if you guys want to check that out, go ahead and, um, go back a video and it's there and it's awesome. So yeah, <laughs> let's go ahead and get into the game. Actually, hold up. Um, they were all going to bed, so we'll actually get back to them when they wake up as usual. So uh, I'll see you guys then. Actually, that's what I forgot to do. In the last park, we actually needed to give Eric a little bedroom. He's downstairs um, sleeping in Kylie's bedroom, which is not okay. So we're going to go upstairs and go ahead and... My, my circles. My circles. They're awesome, though. They give awesome lighting, and they're free, and oh, they're great. Let's go ahead and give him a new room. To my homeboy. Let's see. Um, we're gonna go ahead and give him, let's see what type of furniture we shall give him. I'm thinking, mm, he's kind of grown for this type of theme, I would say. Uh, actually, you know what? No, there's a penguin on it. We're doing it. <laughs> he doesn't get to have too much fun with penguins here in Isla Parody, so, but he, this is the, the story. He doesn't really get to see penguins and Isla Paradiso, but he is a huge fan. So his parents, you know, get him little stuff with penguins on it, so only one could imagine. Aww, poor little boys. <laughs> but, like I was saying, um, what color, what color, what color, this color? What the heck? What the heck? This is my first time actually speaking today. Um, it is a about noon and I just have not spoke to anybody today um I've typed my life out pretty much today so you know it's kind of it's kind of nice to actually open my mouth and speak I guess you know I haven't said anything to anyone all right we'll give him a little lamp that's a little too modern for his room how about a lava lamp you know what Let's do it. You'll be seeing that in my Generations LP because Lava Lamps came with Generations, but beyond the point. You know, I'm actually surprised. All the people who really, really love the Generations LP, it means the world to me, you know, considering that people really, really like it. So I'm glad that you guys like it. It makes me want to produce more of it, you know what I mean? So, you know, I'm, I'm so happy that you I sounded like Alex. So I'm happy that you guys like it. It makes me really happy. <laughs> do it do it what the heck there it goes his room is like really like the theme on his furniture like usually i would just give it a white or something but no we're going all out we're giving him crazy stuff um let's give him a rug too why don't we let's give him i wish there was like some some different types of rugs were like the little boys like here we have a butterfly or a freezer bunny or a heart but nothing for the little boys <laughs> a flower but nothing for like the little boys that'd be awesome if they like had something but they don't we'll give him i don't want to give him a circle rug okay now i'm just you know taking forever oh wait you guys i know what, okay you know what i will do his room really fast and then come back because I know the theme I want to give him. <laughs> Alrighty, so I went ahead and gave him a race car theme. Um, I got gifted this set uh, the other day and I was like, okay, why not? Um, I don't know if everything in here, I'm pretty sure, like, it's from different sets and stuff, but you guys get the main theme of it. Um, so this is it. And then on the other wall we have just some little steering wheels and stuff and a little lamp and that's his room for now I didn't want to decorate too too much and with these windows it is extremely hard to put curtain pick her in up <laughs> to put curtains up and I wanted to put a picture of a car right above his bed but actually you know what we probably could I just went like that we could what am I talking about yeah I am something else. I really, really am. But let's try to find it. 
here it is. Okay, there we go. That's his room, um, and that's about it. So yeah, let's have him actually come up here and sleep in his own bed. How about that? And Kylie can actually get some sleep. So like I was saying, I will get back to you guys when they wake up. Alrighty, all the Sims are in a pretty bad mood, but I thought I would actually show you guys this moodlet that I've never seen before. So say you have a mermaid and they continuously keep showering, you know, taking baths and stuff, uh, instead of heading to the ocean. They will actually get a moodlet that says, <laughs> salt water deficiency. Mermaids need to swim in salt water regularly to keep their scales healthy. And, um, of course, we get the usual flaky. Uh, so I think that was pretty neat. So let's have her uh, go swim in the ocean. I think uh, Kaden needs to when he wakes up as well. Uh, he's all right, actually. But um, I think I will actually show you guys the <laughs> what happens if you don't um, swim. I'll show it to you guys. Uh, so let me have Kaden... Give her some kelp and get out of bed so we can throw some some water on her. But it's pretty neat what happens, you know. I don't know why I get so much pleasure out of it. You know, I like pe you know, seeing people suffer sometimes. But um just wait for her to pass out, I guess. Okay, and eat some kelp. This is honestly the best way to feed your mermaids is just to get some kelp, some fish or something. It's honestly so easy and they they just nourish from it. They just love it. Pass out. Pass out. Pass out. Pass out. <laughs> I guess we need to wait until our three hours are over. Maybe. I got a little excited there. Alrighty, we made about 2,000 simoleons at the retreat. Awesome. Alrighty, Eric's awake. He's having himself some cake. Our little, our little beach boy. I swear, he looks like such a beach boy, like a little surfer. Which actually, hold on. There's so much I want to do right now. <laughs> Let's go to the resort. And place the new, uh, what is it called? I forget again. The wave creator thingy um, in the water. Let's see where I can find it. Right here. right there. I remember saying that I wanted to place it in the video, so now I did, and we can come here and surf. I wonder if little kids can use it. I don't think they can. No, they can't, but that's okay. It's a-okay, and I think because Eric is finally a uh, child, we should promote him with a, a boat himself. Let's go ahead. You know, imagine that, like you turn like, I don't know, eight or something and your parents are like oh by the way here's a jet ski i would be like oh my gosh <laughs> like i would cry i would cry maybe we should start him off with a paddle boat oh crap i forgot that we have to get these start him off with a paddle boat maybe i know if my pa yes start him off with a Swan paddle boat. If my parents got me a swan paddle boat. I would rock that. I'm sorry, but I'm weird like that. That was like my childhood, going to the lake with a paddle boat. Oh, I will never forget that. Buy a resort buffet, buffet table for your resort. Boy, this is not your resort, first of all. So get that out of your head. Don't pee yourself. Are you kidding me? You had to have that cake, didn't you? you yeah. Why? <laughs> Oh, good job. You know what? I'm not even going to allow you to go rinse off right away. You're going to mop that puddle up and then go shower. You nasty. You nasty. Go shower now. Really? 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 All right, don't shower then. Not my problem. <laughs> Why? 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 Everybody else can shower but him. Don't shower. I want you to pass out. Alrighty, Eric, go paddle your way over to, hmm, where should we have him go? We'll have him just paddle out a little, a little bit farther, yeah. And 
have him start to snorkel so we can get his snorkeling level up even though actually you know what that would make no sense because he's a mermaid or a merman so once he turns a teenager i'm pretty sure he's gonna max out the um snorkeling skill anyway so there's really no point but we'll have him go look for some cool stuff i mean he is a merman right he has to love the water so we're gonna have him head out there really quick let's have him uh Pull out his swan paddle boat. How cute. <laughs> um, no matter what age your sim is, you know, child to elder, they can actually use a aqua sled. So we'll upgrade him to the aqua sled once I think he deserves it. You know, he learns to take care of himself instead of pissing himself at the dinner table. Little things like that. But we'll eventually get him one because it's really, really funny seeing, you know, little kids on an aqua sled. <laughs> Because you don't really see that in real life, so it's kind of funny, but... Okay, he almost... Okay, that definitely just went through him. And who is that? Oh, you... Oh, my gosh, it's Gus. Gus? Oh, my gosh. He's like, okay. You want to steal my mom from me? I'm going to kill you. Like, that's his... Oh, my gosh. Gus, why? <laughs> you just, like, potentially killed your little brother? You are evil. You are evil. Like, please. Stop. Stop so we can, um, release that Kraken on you. Really, though. Stop. Gus is one bad boo. He's bad to the bone. Alrighty, so we're here. We're gonna go ahead and just, uh... Actually, let's watch him go windsurfing as a kid. I don't know. I don't know why I find that so fascinating. Ooh. Let's watch him windsurf. We've watched so many people windsurf. Alrighty, so this is a uh, little Eric windsurfing. His has a dolphin on it. Can't wait to upgrade my computer. I'm doing it in September. I'm so excited. Um, anyways. Yeah, so that's Eric windsurfing. Really neat. I actually really like the windsurfing thingy. Alright, who ran us over this time? It's a fairy. And she looks like she has, like, a really bad weave on. Okay. But let's have Kylie eat some food. Um, she has a bunch of meat on her. Let's have her go have a meal. And then go scuba diving. And hopefully when she does, um... Like I was saying, hopefully when she does actually... You know, go underwater and fight a shark. Hopefully she doesn't die. Because that would be horrible and horrifying. And it would just mess everything. Oh, there you go. Hor it'd be horrifying and it would mess everything up. There we go. And here is a little kid on the aqua sled. He looks like he is on a mission. But it's so funny because you don't really see that in real life. Like, I've never seen. I'm guessing this kid's probably eight or something, you know, doing this. That's crazy. You don't see that. You don't see that. It's pretty neat. Alrighty. Oh, that's what somebody also told me. So thank you. I love when you guys inform me on stuff because I actually, you know. Oh, she's dehydrated. <gasps> yes. Yes. Oh my God, her head's under the bed. Alrighty. So basically, she's dehydrated, obviously, right now. It's really scary because you don't know what to do. But you can actually... Well, usually, there we go. She's getting up. I guess we didn't come to her fast enough, but usually you can throw water on the sim. Um, so please, pass out again. Oh, it looks like Kane already did. You asshole. We wanted to watch you. Whatever. So it turns out she already got water thrown on her by her hubby, but pretty much you pass out like that. They get like a gallon of water and they toss it on you and you revive and you're like... <gasps> Oh my god, thank you so much. That's pretty much what happened. It's pretty neat. I liked it. You know, just like a little interaction that was really cool of EA to add in. I, I liked it a lot. So, yeah. <clears throat> but Kylie, hurry up and eat that salad so we can have you head out. But that's also, eh, also what I was uh, trying to tell you guys before she knocked out. She done goofed. Um, on these islands, uh, somebody told me there is a little treasure 
<laughs> can't talk treasure uh, chest that we probably have unlocked because we got all four map pieces and things like that so let's go to the little um places that we do have and see what we got here we have a chest i'm pretty sure this one's already okay it's definitely already opened but what the hell <laughs> because this is going to be a resort we have that just chilling um but he's gonna come over here open that chest and i think we have one more but i probably am wrong um I think that's it. I think that's all we got. But I think it's unlocked now, maybe. I don't remember if we opened it or not, but we'll have to go ahead and see. So he's going to go ahead and head on up. God, I would like to come out and play. No, that's for Generations LP. Any other LP is not getting the imaginary friend. I don't know what it is. There's just something about him. You know, that really scares me. It really, really does. It, it, mm. Okay, so to the person who sent me this message, thank you so freaking much. They told me that there is a house actually on the ocean, I guess, that has um, like a stilted foundation, or I think that's what it's called. I don't know. That you can actually get attacked because um, there's like a bunch of sharks. So hopefully I can find it. Um, I don't know if I'm going to find it. Maybe I can. If we can't, then we're just going to have to, um, try our best with going underwater and finding a shark. But they told me it's like, I forget. Oh, come on. There it goes. Um, not this one. I don't think it's this one. Doesn't look like it. Um, let me read that message again. Alrighty, so after a little bit of searching, I found it. Uh, the way that you can tell if it, this is it is there's actually a little swan boat that comes with it. Um, so she told me, or he, I'm not sure, I'm sorry. Um, is that our old jet ski? I am still on the mission to find it. No. Um, that if you walk off this, there's like a bunch of sharks or something. Um, I mean, I can't find them personally, but what do we have right here? Is that our jet ski? Probably not. I don't think it is. Um, but we can actually scuba dive right here. Where is that? Oh, it's Rocky Reef. It's right there. Um... I'm not sure how this actually would work because I don't really see any but we're gonna go ahead and come here and see how exactly this works hopefully we will get attacked and I think Kaden is actually over there opening that treasure chest right now or on his way actually that was a terrible renderation of his tail um I need to turn up my render a little bit but Let's go ahead and uh, fast forward time a little bit. I'm really, really excited. Oh, I almost like fell out of my chair. That would have been funny. <laughs> yeah, that would have been great. Um, let's see, is she almost there? I think this is it. I'm pretty sure this is it right here. They told me it has like a fence around it and it has a little swan boat that comes with it pretty sure this is it hopefully I'm not wrong I'm pretty sure though um we're gonna go ahead and get in the water and hopefully we're attacked I don't know I'm pretty sure you have to be underwater but this person told me that this is where their sims actually live and um they get attacked all the time or something like that so hopefully we get attacked I'm I'm really hoping we get attacked. You know, not too many people say that. But I'm really I'm really feeling the shark vibes. Like please come take us. Come take us. Alrighty, well we're gonna leave her alone for a minute. Let's see where Caden is. Come on, Caden. 
we have quite a bit to go considering it is all the way over there like our whole little family like just chilling right here oh <laughs> Um, I think we're gonna go ahead and swim over here to, uh, where is it? To the diving point. Um, I'm not sure exactly how this works, to be honest. Um, we will definitely keep trying over here. I, I just need to figure it out, I guess. Um, maybe over here. Oh, yeah. Come swim over here. I mean, I don't know if this would count. Probably wouldn't, um, considering this is uh, just, you know, you see these all over the place. You know, we've been in a swarm of sharks before, and we never got attacked, but we're going to try. Oh, come on now. We're going to have her boat over here. We're going to try to get attacked right here. I'm not sure if this would actually work. Maybe it would. I don't know how this whole shark attack thingy works, but I'm pretty sure you get attacked underwater. Um, but I could be wrong. Who knows, right? Let's see. Also, thank you for everybody who sent me, you know, messages trying to help me out. It means once again so much. <laughs> Attack me. Attack me. <laughs> I don't think anything will happen. I'm pretty sure we have to be underwater. Alrighty. I think so. So we're going to go ahead and... Um, boat here. Oh, wait. What is all that? Over here. What? Oh! <gasps> Oh my god! Oh my god! Now they come! Oh, that is so scary! Oh! You guys! We might just get attacked! I'm so excited! No, come back! Come back! Come back! I wonder what set them off. That is so scary. Go back over. Okay, this is like a mission right here. Go back. Actually, technically, we are on a mission, aren't we? Okay, so he got. Go there, go there, go there. Go away. He got about 1,000 simoleons, uh, gold, iron, pedalium, and some silver. Oh my gosh, please come back. We just want to get attacked, that's all not asking for too much. We're actually giving you a good meal. Eric's got a little bit of a tan going. What? Does he? He is. Look at our little beach boy. Anyways, he's going to have himself um, some green salad. You're hungry. Oh, God damn. Come over here. And we'll give her some kelp really fast. Let's see, kelp. Kelp. She's swimming really fast. Alrighty. Eat two things of kelp. Alrighty, Kylie. Come on, girl. <laughs> Are they back? I wish they were. But they're not. Do you guys see that, though? That was crazy. Maybe if I, um... Like I was saying, if I swim over here like we were... Maybe they will come? I don't know. That's really weird. I feel like we're getting so close to it. So close, but not yet. Oh, come on, sharks. Maybe, maybe they all went to Pearl's Deep. <laughs> we'll try it. Um, but that's crazy. We're, we're definitely going to have to come back here because that's, um, that was amazing at the same time, but crazy. I really liked it. Alrighty, here we are, underwater. Um, I don't see any sharks, what's new? But, uh, just take a nice little dip under here, I guess. 
maybe one will pop up. People tell me, you know, go away for five minutes or go away for a little while and there will be a shark. <laughs> so it's crazy. Though I still can't get over that. That was so scary. <laughs> but I definitely want it to happen again because oh, there's a shark right there. Come underwater. Are you underwater? Come on under. <laughs> we just want to get attacked. Oh the gosh. They're coming. <laughs> Guys, they're coming, I think. There's a couple right here. Come down. Come on. Come on over. Come on over, baby. Come on over. Come on over, baby. We're underwater chilling. You know, we have a bunch of meat on us. Like, come take us, please. Is that too much to ask? You know, you think a shark would be happy to come take you. All right, let's 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 get out of the water, maybe. And maybe it'll come and take us. No, and now they're all gone. WTF, mon. WTF. No, no. Don't go up. <laughs> Don't go up. No! 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 I think I just saw one. Oh, no, no! Kylie! <laughs> Are you kidding me? Kylie, no. No. She just peed herself, too, because there was a shark. No. 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 She's going all the way over here to the island just to pee herself. No. Kylie. No. No. This is not okay. This is not okay. Oh my gosh, you guys. Guys. <laughs> I'm so upset right now. That sucks. Okay. Well, another part with them damn sharks not defeated in the next part we have to i feel it like we're coming so close to it so definitely in the next part hopefully hopefully no promises because we are really slack in here but now that i found this little well i didn't find it the person informed me about it thank you and uh, now that we know this and i can like practically watch the sharks we will definitely have to have an encounter, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I love you guys. This part was really, like, uh, mind-blowing. But I will see you guys in the next part. And love you guys so much. Bye, guys.